Welcome back to the Crazy Foursome, where we turn sustainability and eco-friendly living into a rewarding adventure. Today we're venturing into the world of allotments. Picture this, a lush, productive garden that requires minimal upkeep. Sounds like a dream, right? But hold on to your gardening gloves, because this isn't just a dream. If you've ever felt overwhelmed by the thought of maintaining an allotment, worry no more. With a few smart choices and initial effort, you can reap a bountiful harvest with minimal maintenance. First up, mulching. A thick layer of organic mulch can do wonders for your garden. It's a blanket for your soil, keeping it cozy and moist. But it's not just about moisture retention. Oh no, mulch is a hero in disguise. It's your first line of defense against those pesky weeds. And as it decomposes, it enriches your soil with nutrients, reducing your reliance on frequent watering and weeding. Now that's what I call a triple threat. And while we're on the subject of smart choices, let's talk about plant selection. Not all plants are created equal when it comes to maintenance. If you're looking for a garden that keeps on giving with minimal effort, you'll want to cozy up to perennial vegetables and self-seeding crops. Think asparagus, rhubarb and herbs like sage and thyme. These hardy plants come back year after year, no replanting needed. Then there are the self-seeders, these plants are the gift that keeps on giving. They drop their seeds at the end of the season, and voila, new plants spring to life the following year. Calendula, poppies, and even some types of lettuce are great options. They'll fill your garden with color and life. And the best part? They basically plant themselves. Plants like asparagus, rhubarb, and certain herbs come back year after year, while self-seeders like calendula and poppies regenerate themselves filling your garden with color and life. Watering can be time-consuming, but not if you set up a drip irrigation system. You see, this clever contraption takes the hassle out of hydrating your plants. It delivers water directly to the roots, ensuring they get the moisture they need without wasting a drop. Now, isn't that efficient? And the best part? It's a set-and-forget solution. Once your system is in place, it keeps your garden thriving, even when you're off on vacation or tied up with other tasks. All it requires is a little planning and setup, and voila! Your garden gets the water it needs, when it needs it. But what about those pesky pests that love to munch on your leafy greens and juicy fruits? Well, pest control can also be simplified, and you won't need a single chemical. Enter companion planting, the practice of pairing plants that benefit each other. Some plants naturally repel pests, while others attract beneficial insects that keep those pests in check. For instance, marigolds are known to deter a host of garden pests, while sweet alyssum attracts hoverflies, whose larvae feed on aphids. By choosing your plants wisely, you create a natural ecosystem where each plant plays a role in supporting the others. Companion planting is a fantastic way to enhance your garden's health and yield without resorting to chemicals. And there you have it, a low-maintenance allotment that doesn't skimp on productivity. With just a little bit of planning and some smart choices, you can transform any patch of earth into a bountiful garden. Imagine the satisfaction of stepping into your own backyard oasis, knowing that it thrives with minimal effort from you. Remember the magic of mulching and how it keeps your soil moist, suppresses weeds and nourishes your plants. Don't forget the power of perennial vegetables and self-seeding crops, plants that come back year after year, filling your garden with color and life. Think about the time saved with a drip irrigation system, a set-and-forget solution that ensures your plants get the water they need, even when you're too busy to tend to them. And let's not overlook the natural pest control that comes with choosing plants that repel pests or attract beneficial insects. These are all simple, sustainable solutions that can make gardening a joy, not a chore. And the reward? A vibrant, productive allotment that's kind to the earth and kind to you. Thanks for joining me today on The Crazy Foursome. Remember, a sustainable, eco-friendly lifestyle is within reach, and it starts right in your backyard. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more tips on living greener and saving money. Until next time, happy gardening!